Recent conflicts in Africa, the Middle East, and Central Europe threaten to escalate into international war. As tensions increase, our troops may be deployed to these unstable regions in order to protect our national interests and the ground forces that defend them, a new tactical advantage is required. On April 23, 1991, the United States Air Force announced that Lockheed Martin would develop the next generation of warplanes, the F-22 Air Dominance Fighter. Twin Pratt & Whitney F-119 thrust vectoring engines give the F-22 its tremendous advantage in speed and maneuverability. Recent tests at Edwards Air Force Base have demonstrated the F-22's unique ability to supercruise. At high altitudes, the F-22 can achieve supersonic flight without having to use its afterburners, allowing it to get to the battle faster and stay in the air longer. Built with radar-absorbing advanced composite materials, the F-22 will be able to strike targets virtually undetected this next generation stealth technology builds upon that of the F-117 and the B-2 bomber. Unlike these bombers, the F-22 will be armed with the most sophisticated air-to-air -air ordnance. Test Aircraft 4002 is expected to launch its first AIM-9 Sidewinder in early 2000. The F-22 features the most advanced avionics of any fighter aircraft. Test pilots have been amazed at how easy it is to fly while maintaining complete situational awareness. To minimize costs, a team of over 30 engineers and technicians are evaluating the avionics and radar systems aboard a 757 flying test bed. So far, the F-22 has met or exceeded all Department of Defense program criteria ahead of schedule. In 2005, the first of 339 F-22s is scheduled to enter active duty. Capable of long-range sorties and utilizing the latest in stealth technology, the F-22 will dominate the skies of the 21st century.